hi guys and welcome to the first video of how to make your own custom room in this video first of all I will tell you about the different tools that are required to make your own custom room the first tool is apk tool by using this apk tool you can edit the .jar file or .apk file customize it modify it as you want and then replace the original files the next is kaibing kaibing is linux command prompt that is linux terminal actually for windows the next is fastboot by using this fastboot you can flash the kernel to your devices this is the flashable zip demo provided by me you can directly place the files inside the slash system folder inside the zip and create the flashable zip without re any re any kind of editing uh, updater script or anything like that this is the flash tool by using this flash tool you can flash the stock uh, ftf packages to your devices and also remove the kernels custom kernels this is a live server package because if anything goes wrong then you can flash the stock room and revert to your bricked devices note that this whole tutorial is based on android 2.3.4 and device is xperia mini pro sk17i the next is ftf extractor the ftf extractor helps you to extract the F packages file in the ftf packages you have system.sim user.dsim kernel.sim these files can be extracted using this ftf extractor this is the kitchen file this kitchen file will help you to cook your custom room that is build your custom room add the scripts root privileges or edit the names of the system anything like that the latter is meta and a folder this is the demo meta and a folder provided from my room you can directly place it inside your custom room and edit the updater script and write it as you want and without uh, much effort you can create your updater script this is notepad plus plus if you write your script using the default windows notepad then you will get error 6 error status 6 in your flashable zip and your installation of flashable zip will fail hence you must use this notepad plus plus otherwise you will not be able to execute your flashable zip through clockwork mode for uh, other purposes you can use uh, winrar like software to edit the files in uh, flashable zip uh, sorry flashable zip as well as dot apk files you can use game photoshop to edit the image files etc that depends on your interest and your uh, skill level in which software you are good at so this was all about the basic tools in uh, next video i will tell you how to install these packages how to set up the folders etc so was the next video thank you